welcome to Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, along with Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. The Flyers seem to be checking the boxes in all areas right now, right? And I think when we talked to the coaches this morning, we got that sense that they're very happy with the way that they play. But don't let your play slip. Things are going so well. Push it as far as you can. We are about set to drop the puck as both centers make their way into the dock. The Flames start with possession as we are now underway. Takes it from the right side. Sends the pass over. Here's the pass! And that's stopped by Markstrom. Nothing doing on that. Tries to get the puck over to Tanev. Markstrom's had a lot to do with the team's winning record. His save percentage has been excellent all season. From one point man to another. Just wide! Quick feed to Morrison. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Jostled off the puck. And now it's grabbed by Goudreau. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. The Flames take it along the wing. And the puck leads the zone. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. The game is still scoreless. Philadelphia has won the draw and they take possession here in the open ice. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. He scores! It's always fun to score at home. A crowd cheers so loud, you feel the energy. This early in the first period is a huge boost. When you get in this tight, James, you've got to make a quick move. He goes to the backhand and beats the goaltender. the way that they were able to get themselves into the game quickly, play at the pace they want to, and capitalize on that chance. Nice defensive robbery on that, and it's kicked away. Moves it to Petorier. Passes right to the front. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Markstrom. And he came out and challenged him. Good save. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Who's the puck? Now, Philadelphia's got the puck along the wall. Great defensive stick work on the play. The Flyers take it across the line. Calgary's got the puck. Moves it quickly over to Anderson. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Denies up with the blocker. What a stop by Hart. Coming down the left wing and into the zone. Quick pass to Lindblom. Misses over the net. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Here's a short pass to Stone. And he loses possession of the puck after trying to make one too many moves. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. The Flames gain control of the puck against the wall. Moved up ahead after a nice pass from the right wing. Into the middle of the neutral zone. They fight for it along the boards. Scooped up along the wall by Patrick. The Flyers move it ahead. Quick feed to Lindblom. Puck grab by Gostas Bear. Here's a chance. Stopped by the goaltender. Philadelphia's got the puck along the boards. From the left side, it moves to the middle of the ice. All smart heads up play to put that one away. And they'll be forced to regroup after the puck bounces out of the offensive zone. Scrum along the boards. Grabbed along the board by Lindblom. Sends it in on the attack. Now a quick pass to Levo. Look out, a two-on-one. Coughs up possession of the puck. The Flames scoop it up along the boards. And that pass goes awry. Moves it to Simon. Quick feed down low. And now it's over to Simon. And he puts that one aside with ease.
Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. Philadelphia's ahead, 1-0. The Flames will go to work here in the offensive zone. Let's the wrister go. And he gets his glove out to stop the pinball shot. The centermen glide into position. Philadelphia's got possession here in their own end. They go on the attack from the left side. And that's picked off in front. Calgary's got it against the boards. Here's a chance. Moves it quickly over to Giroux. Looking to set up offensively. Puck picked up by Proveroff. A howitzer. Oh, he gets a piece of it with the glove. Pucks it away to stay on the attack. And he totally whiffs on that one. Puck scooped up by Tanev. Calgary's moving it along the wing. And the puck's back on his blade here at center. Move to the middle. Here's a shot. Oh, just slide in the net. Doesn't miss by much. That's a good shot. Just outside of the cage. Quick pass to Voracek. On the backhand. And he stands tall in goal. The Flames get a hold of the puck along the boards. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Kachuk's got the puck. Trying to get back on the attack now. Oh, and he completely blew it on that miss. Yeah, you got to get it on the net, James. You've got an opportunity to score, and you don't even test the goalie. Here's a chance right out in front, and makes the save. James Passed up ahead. Up. Really good read to find the open forward. Reads it perfectly, breaking up the play. Gets it to the other point, and he makes the save. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. Find some space in the corner. Handles it along the blue line. And that's turned aside by Hart. Picked up along the wall by Backlund. Moves across the point. Slides the puck over. Really good work in the offensive zone here. Excellent effort. Strong defensive effort. And he regains control of the puck. Taken along the wall by Monaghan. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Grabner. Sends a pass over. And the puck skips out of the zone. They'll have to regroup. Picked up along the boards by Monaghan. Receives the pass. Nice pass. Here they are on the attack. Takes the shot. And that one stopped. Here he is with the backhander. Denies him again. Quick reflexes. You make one, you make two stops before the puck is cleared away. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Scooped up along the wall by Patrick. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. Lindblom's got it to the side. And that goes off a player in front. His reflexes on display tonight. Puck dumped in. The Flyers have it against the wall. Tries to get the puck to Patrick. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Stays with it. Battle along the boards. Grabs the puck behind the net, and it's a quick pass to Simone. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. Grabbed along the board by Demers. Philadelphia's got possession here in the neutral zone. Quick feed to Raffle. Too much traffic in the lane. The Flames take it along the wall. Dumps it into the Ozone. Philadelphia is going to play the puck from behind the cage. Moves it over to Demers. From the slot. Too much congestion in front. And a bad pass, and they'll be forced to start all over again outside the offensive end. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Calgary's got possession at center. And now he tries to get it across to Morrison. The Flames look to start the transition game. Philadelphia's got a hold of it against the wall. Here's a short pass to Gustafson. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Takes the feed. Feeds it over to Kovalchuk. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. Here he is in front. Scores! Shot! Goalie just can't 
keep up with this. He's close to the net, but he's still able to have enough room to beat the goaltender. Here in the late goings of the period, we got a tie game. And a solid Lane job tying up his opponent. Number 23, Moves it around along the half wall. Manages to hang on. Turns it away. I like the goalie's positioning here. He was aggressive enough to make a save on a dangerous chance. Provorov's physical play will put him among the league leaders in hits year after year. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. <laughs> Philadelphia's got it, and they're on the attack. Here he is on the tip. Takes the puck along the boards. Big time stop. Right in front of the net. Takes a shot. Save made by the goalie. Back to the point it goes. Jostling for the puck, and he loses control. Denied by Markstrom. Aggressive stop out on top of the crease to make the save on a dangerous chance. Philadelphia's got a hold of it along the wall. Takes the pass. Moves it to Konechny. Philadelphia's got the puck along the wall. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Pumps it away in his own end. Less than a minute to go here in the opening frame. The Flames move it in. Philadelphia's gained possession along the boards. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. Philadelphia's got control of the puck. Pinned up along the boards. The Flames gain possession along the wall. As the puck skips into the crowd to one lucky fan, we'll get a face off here on the ice. Markstrom's on top of this. That's an enormous stop on a scoring chance. Great read by the winger to take possession with the two centermen tied up. And it takes a shot. The blocker saved by Hart. Horn sounds bringing an end to what has been a pretty fun start to this one. Hey, hockey fans. Follow the team all season long on the radio for every minute of play-by-play -play action, both home and away. Or listen to the online simulcast at home or on your smartphone. Still lots of hockey still to come, so get ready here on EA Sports. Both teams back on the ice after the first intermission. Ray Ferraro, James Sabalski ready to bring in the call for period number two. Been a fun one so far. Neither side giving an inch. Still tied here as we open things up in the second. Well, we've got over 20 minutes played thus far. Ray, how have you seen things? The Flames have been grinding away, trying to find a way into the offensive zone and generate some shots. They don't have very many. Probably pretty lucky the game's tied. That's a good heads-up play at center ice. The Flames carried along the wall. And that one's broken up. Moves it quickly over to Morrison. A little dipsy doodle and he loses possession of the puck. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. Quick pass to Voracek. The Flames get a hold of the puck in their own end. The Flyers scoop it up along the boards. And he feeds it down to Giroux. Slides the puck into the offensive zone. From the point, they take control of it. Picked up along the wall by Monaghan. And we've got a two-on-one. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Quick feed to Konechny. Nice zone entry from the middle. Good defensive effort to poke it away. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. And puts it anywhere but the way he wanted it to go. Most dangerous place on the ice. And he can't capitalize. Here's a short pass to Valimaki. Calgary's looking to break out. Handles the puck. Calgary's got it into the offensive zone. Moves it to Kovalchuk and makes the save. Kovalchuk's return will spark this lineup. He gets a shot on goal in his first game back. Hammers it on net. Big stick save by 
the goaltender. Well, what a quick reflex stop that is. Great scoring chance. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. We are all tied up in this one. Ryan's won the faceoff deep inside the offensive zone. Made the stop on that play. Konechny's point streak has been a thing to behold. You start to get superstitious on a run. You do everything the same, you wear the same suit all the time. The setters will glide into the dot. Nice job tying up his opponent. Handles the puck at the point with the steal. Philadelphia's got it along the wall. Slides it diagonally to Lindblom. And they'll be forced to regroup as the puck escapes the offensive end. The Flyers will play it in their own end. Calgary's got the puck along the wall. Levo's got it along the wing. Battling for it along the boards. Couldn't complete the play. Tries to get it over to Sanheim. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Sends it down low. Philadelphia's got the puck behind the net. The Flames will play from the defensive zone. And he's ridden off the puck. Moves it quickly over to Provorov. Takes the feed. Here he is in close. Oh, you can't miss that. Now, somehow I got 408, James. You don't get any if you don't hit the net. Get it on target, man. Quick pass to Gustafson. Philadelphia is playing it through the neutral zone. Calgary's got control of it now from their own end. Nice poke check. Taken by Hayes. He carries the puck up along the wing. Fires it, and he says no! Centered out in front! Here's a chance, and that's blocked! Markstrom's gonna hang on to that one for a whistle. Quickly on top of that, James, he needed a cover there. I love these second looks at this. You see the player transfer his weight, hammer the slapper, but the goalie makes the save. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame, it's all tied up. Lindholm's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Takes the feed at center and moves forward. Hangs onto the puck. We've got a penalty coming up on the play. Now you react, you go to get the puck, and you stick your stick into the guy's feet. Down you go. Two minutes off to the box. A chance to capitalize here on the power play. Their first power play of the night. They've worked on it, and it starts with the faceoff. Win the draw, start moving Ladies the puck quickly before you shoot it. Fires it! Makes a save! Cool and calm under pressure! Seven minutes, 56 seconds. Puck possession so critical. Another faceoff coming up here. The Flyers take possession off the faceoff. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Gets it out of his own end. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. And now he moves it to Voracek. Makes a move and the puck hops away from him. There are times you try to do... Oh, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. Officials blowing the play dead. We've got a penalty on the way here. The Flyers don't like it, but they'll serve two in the penalty box. A lot of times the player won't think that's even a penalty, but you go that far to make the hit, the referee's radar goes up. Batten down the hatches. Things should open up here with a little four-on-four -on, -four on the ice. The game on almost every level has moved to a puck possession game. Really, really important four-on-four. -four. Scrum ensues along the boards. Taken along the wall by Giordano. Quick feed to Hayes. Back at the point, they set it up. Hayes setting up against the wall. Jocelyn for the puck, and it's knocked away. Sends the pass over. And now it's grabbed by Levo. Out front, wrists one, and gets a piece of it with the trapper. Here's a short pass to Hayes. And now he moves it quickly to Demers. Couldn't find the intended target. 
And he slides it quickly to Falamaki. Pass across to Grabner. Oh, had a chance to make a nice move, and the puck disagreed with him. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. Calgary's in transition. Huge steal in his own end. It's a two-on-one. Calgary's got the puck in their own end. Across the line and on the attack. Here he is in front. Puts it in for the go-ahead goal. Control the game now. You finally got the lead. You've worked so hard to get in front. Don't give it up now. This puck bounces off the goaltender the first time. The shooter's the next guy in position. The D can't turn quick enough, and he puts it away into the net. The Flames get in front here in the second. It's been a pretty tight game, not much on either side, but they've got the lead now. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. The Flames now have a short power play after the penalty expires. Nice zone entry from the right side. Moves it to Kovalchuk, and he comes up with it. Picked up along the boards by Kovalchuk. Backwards, scores with a man advantage. Over the last couple of games, the signs were there that this power play was going to break out. They start to move the puck around and don't score tonight. They move it around and they do cash in. Oftentimes a goalie will drop in the butterfly, take the chance that he's got everything covered. Not so here. This is up over the glove. It's a beautiful shot. to center ice for the faceoff. I see a lot of movement, a lot of talking on the bench right now. What's the message, Ray? Coaches are going up and down the bench, telling the players to stay on it. Flames Don't back up. On the power and tries to make a diagonal pass to Kachuk. Here's an off-hand rush. He says, let's get physical on that play. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Sends a pass over. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. Good hit to bump him off the puck. Move to the middle. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. The Flyers going to work on offense. Gets in front of it. Markstrom's had to do his part. He's had a good night in the goal, but at the other end, they've been really sharp around the net. Past the midway mark of the frame, the Flames have all the momentum right now, leading by two. Steps in and takes the puck. Passes it to Ryan. Moves it quickly over to Levo. Calgary's got him along the wall. Nothing. You can go games without a chance from here. Quick pass to Levo. Here's a shot. Comes up with the stop. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Morrison's won it in their own end. The Flyers have it now. And he slides it quickly to Voracek. On the attack along the boards. Now a quick pass to Voracek. Takes a shot and puts it high. All right, the goalie had to dock that thing was so high. Along the right side into the offensive zone. Makes the save. The Flyers gain control of the puck against the wall. Philadelphia is moving it up the ice. Knocked away. Puck grabbed by Gostas Bear. Referee signaling for a penalty. Looks like we got a hooking call coming up. Here comes the sentence. And it's going to be two minutes for hooking on the call. A lot of people debate, is this a lazy penalty, the hook? I don't know if it's lazy all the time, but it's a penalty of being out of position. Your stick's parallel to the ice. You get called all the time. The Flames send their man advantage unit out once more. They've been successful on the power play already, James. 
So now you get another opportunity. Do not relax. Go pile it on and get another one. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Throws it in. Calvary's got the puck along the boards. Receives the pass. Scooped up along the wall by Giordano. And it's a quick pass to Goudreau. And now he angles it across to Kachuk. Here they come up along the wing. Calgary's going to play it from the corner. Philadelphia's got the puck in the defensive end. Provorov's got it across the line. Right in front. That's blocked. Picking up some steam at center ice. Here's a shot denied by the goaltender. Philadelphia's got it in their own zone. A little crash and a banging force to the turnover. And a strong effort on that play. Quick feed to Konechny. Can't connect. Levels him with the hit. Comes up with the stop. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. The Flyers have it against the wall. Here's a shot. Overshot it. Sometimes the only place you have is up over the goalie's shoulder. Sometimes you airmail it. With possession along the wall. Got some good footwork to kick it away. The Flames get a hold of the puck along the boards. Looks to set up at the point now. That pass doesn't go. Moves the puck. Nice speed at center moves up ahead now. With the stop. Calgary's got a hold of it against the wall. Hammers it on net. Great stop by Hart. The Flyers gain possession of the defensive zone. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Stopped by the goaltender. Again, the denial by the goaltender. Stop one, stop two. The goalie makes a couple of excellent saves. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. Uh, the defenders can regroup right now. That's a long time they've been chasing the puck around in their zone. They look like they've got nothing left in the tank. The Flames have generated plenty of quality scoring chances and a big reason why they lead late in the second period. And sneaks in and grabs possession. And a puck check knocks the puck away. Taken by Ryan. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Stopping the play. Here in the late going of the frame, the Flames are up 3-1. Ryan's one possession. Grabner's got it in the offensive zone. Maintains possession. Too many bodies in the way. Enters the offensive zone from the left. Here's a short pass to Giroux. Slides the puck over. Gives them nothing in front. He ran right through him on that hit. Lined him up, timed it perfectly. The centermen glide into position. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. Denies him! Philadelphia's got a hold of it along the wall. Calgary's got the puck. Nice pass. Here they come. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Takes a shot. Stopped by the goaltender. Philadelphia's gained possession along the boards. Along the half wall with the puck. And now he moves it quickly to Provorov. Oh, gets a paddle on it. What a stop by Markstrom. Tough enough to make the save unless you can see it. He's got to fight his way and find the puck. Markstrom's always a battler. And here he makes a great save on this chance. Calgary's up for good reason. They have been the more complete team offensively, which is why they lead late in the second. Patrick's won the draw. Shot! Oh, what a save with the stick by Markstrom. Calgary's got a hold of the puck. And he slides it quickly to Mangiapane. From center, they get into the attacking area. He's only one goal away from his next real achievement. You know he'd like to get it here. Well, you're not going to get much better scoring chance than that one, but the goaltender makes an excellent stick save. 
here in the late goings of the period. Been a pretty good offensive display, at least for one side. 3 1 is where we sit. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. He loses his balance on the play. Up along the wing. Moves it to Konechny. The Flames gain possession along the wall. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. And he slides it quickly to Simone. Made the stop on the play. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. Lindholm's won the draw here in the offensive zone. And he makes the easy save. Puck picked up by Gostas Bear. Smart defensive play there. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Period comes to an end, and lucky us, we've got one more period to go in what has been a fun one this evening. It's time to support those around us with our monthly food drop. Bring three non-perishable food items, and you can receive a free team poster. What's in store for the third period? Let's tune in to find out just moments away. are lined up and they are ready to get this third period underway. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Goudreau's got it into offensive territory and he can't hang on after that hit. Feeds the puck over to Giroux. Now a quick pass to Morrison. Here's a shot and there's the save. Calgary's done a wonderful job putting a lot of pucks on net, and they lead it early in this third period. Offense his own face off, and he wins the draw. Feeds the puck to Lindholm. Strong defensive effort. Takes the stretch pass in the open ice. Love the way he moved that puck up quickly. That opportunity is rejected. We're still in the early stages of this period. Calgary's got a 3-1 lead as they have dominated for the most part in this. Puck scooped up by Giordano. Takes the feed. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. And they fail to go take to take. The Flames scoop it up along the boards. Moves it quickly over to Kovalchuk. The Flyers have it from their own end. Moves the puck up to Konechny. Slides it to Giroux. Pass right in front, and that one's broken up. And now it's over to Kovalchuk. Takes the pass, denies him in front. Great tracking, he finds the puck, he gets the glove up, makes the save on a dangerous chance. The setters will glide into the dot. Sneaks away with the puck after he was tangled up on the draw. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. Tries to feed it over to Gostaspair. Oh, he'll feel that one. And now it's grabbed by Van Riemsdyk. Great save by the goaltender on that redirect. made an excellent stop here. He follows the puck and shuts down the scoring chance. Calgary's turned good defense into good offense as they lead it early in this third period. Snatches the puck with the two centermen locked up. Gains the zone from the right side. Here's a chance up front, and that's broken up. Quick pass to Lindblom. The Flyers are on the attack. Here's a shot, just wide of the net. Calgary's got the puck along the wall. Quick feed to Raffle. Bumped off the puck. Fails to find the open man. Here's a chance, a two-on-one. And that one's turned away. 
Hart's going to hang on for a whistle here in the third. Well, there's not much time left here as you get into the final 20 minutes. The game's close. A mistake now would be critical. Lots of time left in this period. Calgary's got a 3-1 lead. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Moves it to Hayes. From the left side, they gain the zone. Grabbed along the board by Bennett. And a penalty coming up here as the officials all over that as they saw him slow him up. And the puck stopper tags his man to get the extra attacker on the ice. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Time for the official to pass down his sentence. Hayes is off to the box, hooking the call. Well, when you stop your feet, you're almost advertising to the official to keep looking. There's the hook. The Flames once again send out their power play unit. When you've already scored on the power play and you get one now, you can't wait to get over the boards to get started again. Stick saved by Hart. After that stop, puck goes out of play. We got a face-off looming. Nearing the midway mark of the period, the Flames have been getting solid offensive contributions, leading 3-1. And a good read to get possession there with the two centermen tangled up. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. And now he tries to get it across to Morrison. And the puck leaves the zone going back to center ice. And it's a quick pass to Sandheim. Into the attacking area from the left side. Here's a blast! Oh, comes up with a stop. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. Calgary's on the attack. Philadelphia's got a chance to work the transition game now, shorthanded. The Flames gain control of the puck against the wall. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. Answered the call there. High-quality chance, high-quality save. Hart's able to bail his defense out here. A bad pinch at the other end of the ice leads to a two-on-one, and he makes the save. The Flames have been the aggressor offensively tonight as they continue to lead in the third. And with the two tied up off the faceoff, a great read to grab possession of the puck. Big play inside the defensive zone. Here's a short pass to Lawton. Philadelphia's got it across the line. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. Couturier's in good position to create a scoring chance, but he bobbles the puck, and the chance is gone. Oh, look at that. Here we go. We got a penalty coming up right here. There's the whistle. Penalty coming up. The Flames have been called for hooking. It doesn't take very long to get on the wrong side of the play. You're a step behind. You've got to slow that guy down. You can't catch him. Maybe you can get away with a hook. Not here. Just tried to play catch up and got burned. A little more room out there with a little four-on-four. Four. If you can get the puck early on a four-on-four, four, the key is to hold on to it as long as you can. Wear the opponent down. Make yourself develop a really good scoring chance. Excellent stick work on the play. And as he stumbles, he coughs up the puck. Feeds it to Voracek. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. Denies that opportunity. Can't hang on to the puck after the play. Gives him a whack, and the officials are going to call this one. Official blows the whistle. Let's see what the call is. Kudrow's hack, not a popular one in the eyes of the officials here. That's a bad reaction. He's beat. He's out of position. He just turns around and whacks. Just a good old-fashioned hack. And with the call, it's now a four-on-three power play coming up. When you have a four-on-three power play, you can work a two-on-one up high. You should be able to get a really good one-timer. A chance in front! Big save! The Flames have possession shorthanded. They get it out of the defensive end. Philadelphia's got the puck along the boards. The Flames have it in the offensive end. Chaps the puck away. Philadelphia's looking to break out of their own end. Takes it to the front! Calgary's going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. The Flyers have it against the wall. Angles it over to Hayes. And now he moves it to Couturier. Handles the puck. Taken by Couturier. Takes a hit but still hangs on to the puck. Calgary's penalty killers get a hold of it. 
Picked up along the wall by Valimaki. Scrum along the boards. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Stones him in front. Trying to end this siege. And that one's blocked. They'll keep it on the attack. Philadelphia's got the puck in their own end. Grabs control of it at the point. Right in the slot. And that one's broken up. Great block there. And the puck is cleared to a safer spot. Philadelphia's got a hold of it against the wall. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Battling for it along the boards. Philadelphia's got a hold of it along the wall. Pass right on the doorstep. Back to the net. They score. I like the way they use their manpower advantage to their advantage. They move the puck quickly. The penalty killers just couldn't catch up. If you can work yourself in that close to the net and then get loose, man, you're just hoping somebody can find you. He one times that for a goal. The Flyers have got a big one here in the third now. Well, you gotta be careful that the clock melts away fast on you, but now they've got a chance. Puck is dropped and play resumes. The Flyers take it across the line. And the puck skips away after that move. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Kachuk. Sends it across. Whoa. able to work his way into the low slot to take that path. He doesn't stop it, so the goalie can't catch up to it. St. Louis is the final team on this homestand. You got a sense that the coaches were almost ready to get out of here after this, right? Yeah, for sure they are. They, they think changing it up a little bit keeps the players sharp. Moves it up through the middle for the right. Can't maintain possession after that hit. Giordano's got control of it now behind the cage. And he slides it quickly to Goudreau. The Flyers have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Here they come on the attack. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Through center along the wing. Dumps it in. Denied by the goaltender. Takes the feed. Puck knocked loose in the neutral zone. Gostas Bear's got it in the defensive end. And now he angles it across to Lindblom. Pokes the puck away. Takes it at center. Cuts to the paint. Oh, what a stop by Markstrom. Moves it quickly over to Stone. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. Calgary's moving it into the offensive end. the pass over. From point blank range, and no one's blocked! Dumped in and they'll go off. The Flames have played the puck from behind the net. Sends a pass over. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Keeps hold of the puck. The Flames gain possession in their own end. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Snaps one on net, blocked in front. Taken along the wall by Stone. With the puck inside the defensive zone. Nice zone entry on the left side. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Scores! Well, how does this change the perception of this game now? Well, all of a sudden the other team's back on their heels. They're only one goal behind now. They keep pushing, maybe you get another. The good thing he one times his puck, the goalie almost gets there, but the pass is on his tape in the low slot, and he beats him clean. The Flyers are setting this up for an interesting finish here, Ray. A lot more interesting than it was a couple of minutes no ago. Kidding. Now, just down one, James, they can do this. Philadelphia has won the draw. 
Quick cool. pass to Voracek. Tonight, they have turned good defense into solid offense, and they lead here in the third. Buck is dropped, and we are back underway. Tosses it on to Couturier. Calvary's got control of it now from their own end. Tries to dangle, and the puck skips away. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. The Flames get a hold of the puck along the boards. Moves it to Lindholm. Grabs the puck and looks to make something happen. Can't catch up to the pass. Drives to the sweet spot. Here's a short pass to Goudreau. Takes it right in the chest. Hart's going to cover it up. He's been busy tonight, Ray. And been good. A lot of times you get busy and worn down. I think that's why you jump on it, freeze it in a close game. Here in the later stages of this period, the Flames lead at 4-3. Calgary's got it in the offensive zone. With the stop. Takes a hit, he goes down to the ice and coughs off the puck. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Tries it to the crease. He was locked in there. I don't know that you can shut him down. I think the best you can hope for is just to minimize the damage he inflicts on a nightly basis. The Flames lead it late in this third period. Philadelphia's won the faceoff. And the lane's clogged up blocking that. Moves it quickly over to Ryan. And now he moves it quickly to Levo. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Into the attacking end. Aaron pass, and the play's broken up. And that one's broken up. The Flames take it along the wall. The Flyers get a hold of the puck. Quick pass to Lindblom. Here's a chance right in front. Stopped by the goaltender. The shooter's right in the guts of the ice, but the goalie squirms up, spreads out, and makes the save. Pumps the puck away. The Flames looking against the half wall. And they can't connect. Receives the pass. On the doorstep, backhander, and he denied that opportunity. Markstrom's right on top of this scoring chance. Nowhere for the puck to go. A big face-off here inside the offensive end. The Flames win it in the defensive zone. Bennett's lugging the puck. Directs it on over to Mangiapane. The Flames move to the offensive zone. One minute left. Almost he lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Played big in the moment there. Under a minute to go here in regulation time. Right on the doorstep. Great pad save. Really good positioning as he makes the stop from in tight. Stopped by the goaltender. The Flyers really need a goal here. They pull the goalie and the extra attackers out. Calgary's got it in their own zone. Towards the gaping net, can't get it to go. The Flyers move it in. Tried to get 2-Q with it and loses possession. Oh, he looked like he was in a good spot there. He bobbled the puck. Now he's got to find it again. Score! Oh, there it is, game. And eventually, if you give up chances, you're going to give one up. But I thought it was too late. Yet they find a way to level the game off. They really executed this perfectly. The goalie got out of the net.
set quickly. The attacker joins the play, and shortly after, it's in the net. Puck possession, so critical. Another face-off coming up here. This neutral zone face-off set to go, and we are back underway. Slides it across. Stopped by the goaltender. He's sharp on this one. Out on top of the crease aggressively to make the save. Time of the goal. 19 minutes. Now we'll get another look at this. That's a good shot, but the goalies get the blocker up to make the save. A critical draw here. Morrison's won a big draw on their own end. And he slides it quickly to Sandheim. There's the horn. Regulation time has expired. And we are off to overtime. Don't miss the chance to see the greatest talents in the world when they visit our city. See the official arena website for details on upcoming concerts. A little bonus hockey is coming up, and it's coming up next. Just moments away from overtime. Oh, you can feel the tension in this arena. Sudden death overtime is underway. Calgary's got the puck along the wall. And now it's over to Tanev. Calgary's got the puck along the wall. The Flyers take possession in the defensive end. Move to the middle. Chase right in front. Blocker saved by Hurt. Sends one across. Another stop by the goaltender. That's why a goalie can never relax. He makes one stop. Now he's got to be sharp to make another. Philadelphia's gained possession along the boards. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. And down he goes as the puck goes free. A chance to end it for the win. Oh, and he can't finish. Oh, there's going to be a penalty on this play here, James. There's the whistle penalty coming up. Looks like tripping the call. Sometimes they're lazy, sometimes they're just bad luck. A long four on three man advantage looms here as we get set to drop the puck. Oh, thank you very much. A power play in overtime, a chance to put this game away. You've earned the power play. Now you want to make sure that you cash in. And the puck clears the zone. Slides it quickly to Couturier. Philadelphia's got the puck against the half wall. What a steal in his own end. Quick feed to Provorov. Takes a shot and makes the save. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. Off the try, and a nice job locking up his opponent. And the puck leaves the zone. From their own end, trying to kickstart this power play. Moves the puck along the half wall. Looking to end it! Scores! And that's the game! And take it in overtime! Philadelphia's playmakers, the difference here as they come away with the overtime victory. You can see their coach's fist pump behind the bench. The overtime win always is a little sweeter. I like the skill here, James, to make the pass and then to receive and shoot it all in one motion. Razor, they're getting the second ovation from the crowd. Did you guys have this when you were playing? No, we had none of this. Nobody saluted the fans back like this. There seemed to be no real connection to who was watching and who was playing. For Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. We'll see you next time we drop the puck.